everything here is fine. If they say go left, you go right, fine. If they say don't cough, you cough. channel is your girl Antoine yeah welcome to my youtube channel once again to my returning subscribers thank you so much thank you for always being there thank you for always coming back thank you for your beautiful comments thank you for subscribing if this is your first time do well to subscribe and god will bless you and also turn on the notification bell so that each time I upload a new video, you will be the first to be notified. So on this video, I will be sharing with you another experience on my job search in Dubai. Yeah. So guys, when I came to Dubai, I also met some Cameroonian ladies and other nationalities that were looking for job as well i associated we moved together to submit cvs and like that so it's always good when you come to a new environment try to associate with people share ideas because you do not know where your help will come from so this faithful day i have known two ladies coming same from cameroon we're into the job search market together so this fateful morning she called me and said there is a vacancy somewhere in a school i should meet her in a particular spot for those of you who have been in dubai or those of who are you who are present in dubai i'm talking of abu hair most people know abu hair abu hair is a learning spot for africans like particularly for Cameroonians. You learn in Abu Hair before you start thinking of where else to set to. So Abu Hair is a very popular place in Dubai. It is Duhala in Cameroon. That is just Abu Hair for you. So I was in Abu Hair by then with her. So she told me I should meet her in a particular spot. So we go to this interview location together in the school. So that early morning, after the other disappointment I had with one fake agent, so this early morning I said, "Wow, since this one does not have to do with an agent, I so so much believe it will work." So I went to this particular spot. Like um, for those of you who are in Dubai, um, small signal. So I have already crossed the signal correctly. When you cross the signal, you have to know the signal signs. When you are in New Dubai, try to ask. Don't just go to the highway and start doing your own. Like you cash fine. Everything here is fine. If they say go left, you go right. Fine. If they say don't cough, you cough. Fine. <laughs> so the signal was to cross the signal when it's red. You can only cross the signal. Pedestrians can only cross the signal when it, is, when it is green. So I have crossed the signal correctly because I went there. They were not there. The two other ladies were not there. I crossed the signal correctly, went to the other side and was waiting for them. So in a few minutes time, I saw them coming. We were almost late. So they hurriedly crossed the signal when it was not time to cross though a vehicle was not coming they crossed the signal when it was too red and unfortunately in a distance a policeman was approaching in his car he was not dressed in his police but i didn't even take note uh, and took note so when they heard me cross the signal when it was red we just saw this car approach who they disbanded why do you have to they just told me because I was so very new here, but though I understood that I have to press in a minute. They told me I turn it wrong, wrong, wrong. I just followed them. I was not the offender. I didn't do any wrong, but I was so confused and scared. I just had to start running with them. The man was following us with his car, so we have to take like shortcuts, you know, like the black man would say, come short. We have to pass in between houses. He was confused. He could no longer follow us. 
So from there, I have to learn this lesson. Please, if you are new in Dubai, take your time, ask questions, and know what to do and what not to do. So on this video, this is the opportunity to tell us some of the things we are not supposed to do in Dubai. You are not supposed to cross the signal when it is still red. When it is red, it's, it shows a sign for vehicles to start moving. And at that point, it is very, very, very dangerous for a pedestrian to cross. If you try it, it's your fault. You have to cross the signal when it shows green and there is a logo that does a, a, a logo like a human being trekking. Yeah, that's a green a, a, a logo that shows that it's time to cross. You see a, 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 a starting human being on that in green and the sign that says we should now cross. It's now, cross. It's now time for you to cross. The, the road is clear. It's free from passing vehicles you cannot cross. So you should not cross the signal wrongly. If you do so, you are at risk. Your life is at risk. A vehicle on speed can hit you and from there you can lose your life or sustain a serious injury. Secondly, if the police happen to see you, like they did with us, but fortunately for us, we have to run away. If the police happen to see you, you have fine. Second point, what you're not supposed to do in UAE, you are not supposed to travel without your bus card. This card, like you, 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 you have to have your card that you pack in the bus and in the metro. You are not supposed to steal the bus or metro if you are caught. Fine. Third point, what you are not supposed to do in Dubai, you are not supposed to eat, chew, or drink water in the metro or the bus. You are not supposed to do that. If you do that, fine. So if you are a newcomer, you are a JJC, you are a newbie in Dubai, you are not supposed to do to eat in the metro nor in the bus. The fourth point, you are not supposed to move around without your ID card, your Emirates ID card, for those who have the Emirates ID card. If you are on tourist visa, you are to move your visa, and if you are afraid that no, my visa copy will get missing, do your best to at least have a photocopy or have a visa copy on your phone. So, so that in case of any encounter with the police, you have to identify yourself that you are a tourist. This is your the photocopy of your tourist visa. Or if you are a resident, you have to show your resident ID card. You don't just move around like that. So, guys, I hope you learned something from this video. If you are new, please follow the rules. This country is very strict. They have their rules. If you follow their rules, you will never, never get into trouble. If you don't follow, ready to pay fine, yeah, fine there, fine this year and then. So thank you so much. Oh, leave your comment down in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe and also turn on your notification bell for new uploads. Thank you so much. Stay blessed. Stay safe. Bye.